Now to people across the country remembering Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. 50 years after his assassination. Right now, thousands are gathered at the site of the shooting to honor and remember the civil rights hero. Channel 2's Sion Rhodes has been covering the events, remembering Dr. King in Memphis, and she joins us live now with more. Sion. And there is a huge crowd that has been gathered here all day long for the events happening here at the National Civil Rights Museum. But well before these kicked off at 10 o'clock, there was a recreation of the march that brought Dr. King here all those years ago. Will you march onward today? Hundreds of union workers gathered in downtown Memphis for a rally in honor of Dr. King's commitment to the labor movement. Yes, King was in Memphis back in 1968 to support striking black sanitation workers fighting for better pay and safe working conditions after two men were killed on the job. It's not just about worker, workers' rights, it's about humans' rights as well. It is a struggle these Houston members of Unite Here, a hospitality union, say still exists today. That's why the last 50 years we've been trying to find different ways to take what Martin Luther King taught us and feed off of that to where we are now. Even third graders from a Memphis charter school participated, taking their lessons on social justice from the classroom to the streets. Years ago, something happened that was very special and like my ancestors were there and I want to be there too. Older generations hoping these children will finish the work started by Dr. King. I'm hoping with this young generation that they've caught on to what it means to get out there and to march and stand up for what you want, what you want. I'm hoping that they're going to make a difference. And the musical performances and the speakers continuing here throughout the afternoon and early evening. Coming up at 5 on Channel 2, we're going to introduce you to a Houston artist and professor who's going to share his story of growing up in Memphis and as a teenager participating in the marches that Dr. King was here for. Reporting live from Memphis, Sion Rhodes, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right, Sion, thank you. And there's another event honoring the life and legacy of Dr. King taking place tonight at the University of Houston. It begins at 545 at the A.D. Bruce Religion Center off Cullen Boulevard. The Reverend William Lawson, who was a longtime friend and colleague of Dr. King, is tonight's featured speaker. You can learn more about today's events honoring Dr. King at clicktohouston.com. You will also find testimonies from other civil rights leaders about the impact Dr. King's message still has today. Plus, five things you may not know about the legendary civil rights leader. That's all on our website, clicktohouston.com.